In today's Galileo tour, we're going to look at our rigorous test items, and we'll highlight a variety of item types spanning multiple subjects and grade levels. Using ATI's research-based item banks, educators can find a wide selection of pre-built items needed to engage students in complex thinking and measure student ability. There is over 160,000 items in the ATI Secure and Community Item Banks to select from, including technology-enhanced items. These items include metadata such as depth of knowledge level and provide item response theory-based item parameters such as difficulty. Plus, districts have the option to access additional item banks, including the Inspect Item Bank. Now let's go further. The first item type we'll cover is the Interactive Linear and Volume Measurement item. This type of item enables students to interact with a graphic and create a visual representation of their response. Here the student would demonstrate an understanding of volume measurement by showing how the height of water changes based on the dimensions of the container. Next we have a sequencing item. This requires students to order item choices in the correct sequence. Depending on the context, item choices might include events, objects, values, or steps of a process. For example, here the student would drag and drop the events from the story into the correct order. Next, we have a selectable text item. This item allows students to select a portion of the text, such as a word, phrase, or sentence, as their response to the question. One or more responses can be selected. Here the student would click on the sentences that belong in the summary of this story. Next, we have a classifying item. This presents a student with a set of choices and boxes representing various categories. The student is expected to drag the choices into the boxes representing the category to which they belong. Here the student would drag and drop the mathematical expressions to classify them. Next, we have an interactive early elementary audio item. This involves embedded audio that, when played, reads aloud the question and the response options. This is beneficial for students in kindergarten and first grade who cannot yet read on their own. The audio presentation is standardized and makes it easy for teachers to test multiple children at once. Here the student would play the question and choose the correct word that belongs in the sentence. With this one, we have an open response item. This is a type of open-ended item where the student provides an extended response that demonstrates their knowledge and reasoning. Here the student would use the information found in the text and graphic to explain why the day of the week can't be a function of the observed temperatures. You'll also notice the text editor toolbar above, which comes in handy for formatting and inserting symbols. Now here's an item that goes a step further, the multi-part item. This item helps illustrate a student's reasoning through their responses to a series of related questions. Multi-part items are beneficial because they can assess knowledge related to multiple standards and typically reflect a higher depth of knowledge level. Here, the student uses the information presented to respond to both a multiple choice item and an open response item. Next, we have an interactive labeling item. This item requires students to identify the parts of an object by dragging and dropping labels onto a diagram. In this case, label the parts of an animal cell. In this next item, we have an expanded selected response item. This allows students to select one or more responses from a list of choices. This item type can accommodate multiple correct responses as well as partial credit. Here, the student would select the two chemical properties of copper. The last item we'll cover is from one of the optional item banks that districts can choose for an additional fee. In this example, we have an equation response item from the Inspect item bank. This item asks the student to give their response using the keypad, which allows them to construct a mathematical response such as a number, expression, or equation. In this case, the student responds with a fraction. The items we've highlighted are just a few examples of the high quality item types available in the ATI Secure and Community Item Banks. 
Galileo's item banks are aligned to individual state standards for grades K through 12 in math, English language arts, and science, as well as Common Core state standards and next generation science standards. With the ATI Secure and Community Item Banks, educators can select items that best address the range of skills reflected in the standards and the diverse ways students express their knowledge. Galileo tours dig deeper into the tools and technology found in Galileo. Continue to learn by accessing other Galileo tour videos from the Assessment Technology Incorporated YouTube page. To see a live demo, contact us today.